Boy, I thought about it. <laughs> Boy, we can have strength tonight. <laughs> Hallelujah. Ever see somebody didn't have enough strength to say no to the devil <laughs> when he comes along, <laughs> brings temptation, brings aggravation, and, and they just go right along with it? <laughs> Brother, we need to be strong enough in Jesus to say, no, devil. <laughs> no, I don't want no part of that. <laughs> I'm here to tell you we can be strong in the Lord, in the power of his might. Hallelujah. I thought about we're stronger than the storms. We're th stronger than the troubles. Through and by Jesus Christ, brother, he's got all power. And he's given it to us. We can use it. He's given us a name that's above every name. The name of Jesus is stronger than cancer. The name of Jesus is stronger than death itself. Oh, my God. Let's be strong in the Lord. Let's show some devils through your muscles and let him know where you stand. You ever see somebody just walk in somewhere and boy, they look strong. Oh, look at that guy. Oh, look at him or look at her. Boy, they look strong. Uh oh, hey man, that's the way the devil needs to see us tonight. Strong in power, strong in grace, strong in the word of God, strong in believing. Every time the devil looks at you, he needs to go, whoa, he looks strong. I ain't gonna mess with him because he's got the real deal. Oh, I thought about Samson. Boy, he was strong, wasn't he? Hey, man, where did his power come from? Where did his anointing come from? It come from on high. God anointed him with such a great power. He took a donkey John bone and whooped and killed and slew the whole Philistine army right by himself. That's how strong we can be in God tonight. Brother, hey, man, we can slew these devil spirits that's on people's lives. We can take authority over drug addiction. We can take authority over this. We can start naming and claiming. We can say, or dry up and die at the root. We got power in the name of Jesus. Brother, let's use our power. Boy, I thought about it. A strong man, a strong boy, or a strong girl. Boy, that's who we need to be tonight, Brother Jim Stewart. Hey, man, strong. Thank God. We need to get our spiritual muscles working. Thank God. Get all pumped up in the power of God. Hallelujah. I've seen some muscle in him and men in this old world. They couldn't even wear regular shirts. They was busting right out of them. Hey, that's the way we need to be in the spirit when it comes up serving the almighty living God. Let the devil see you pumped up and ready to go. Hey, man. <laughs> Woo, I thought about when a strong man is armed, he keepeth his goods. But when the stronger than he comes upon him, he spoils him. Brother, he takes his goods. We need to be strong in the Lord and let the devil know where we stand tonight. Hallelujah. Strong in his power. Strong in his might. Strong. Amen. Let the weak say, I am strong. Brother, we need to be a strong Christian. Let people see your light. Let it be a strong light. Don't let it be dim and flickering. Let it be strong and bright and shining to a lost and dying world that's on their way to hell unless they change their ways. Brother, amen, we need to be strong enough to tell them that Jesus can save you tonight. Strong, brother. Oh, I, I got so much respect. I've got the uttermost respect for a strong man or a woman of God. Amen. That's got the real deal. That ain't going on in with every kind of new doctrine coming out. That's steadfast, unmovable, unshakable, strong in the power of God. I got respect for people like that. Brother, I respect preachers that have stood in the way, in this good old time way on that street called Straight, and not got over here in left field somewhere, not got into the wide and broad path, but brother, continuing in the right way. I have respect for people like that. Hey. That's the way we need to be, strong in Jesus. We need a strong heart tonight that's full of God, full of him. Hey, man, I want you to think and realize something tonight. Hey, man, you know, talking about medical issues, a lot of people's got heart troubles. Hey, they got clogged arteries. Sometimes they can put a stent in. Sometimes they can open heart surgery. Sometimes you know what I'm talking about. They have to get in there and clean that heart out. Boy, I'm glad tonight I've got a strong heart for God. They ain't nothing clogged it up. It don't need no stints. It's on fire for the Lord. Thank God. 
it. It's strong. It's strong, brother. I want people to be able to see that, brother Donnie. I don't want them to see me. I want them to see him that's in me. Greater is he that is in me than he that's in the world. How strong do you appear to people? Amen. How strong is your faith to people? Oh, have they got enough confidence in you to ask you to pray for them? Have they got enough confidence in you to say, lead me to Jesus or tell me about the Lord? Brother, we need to be that kind of strong is what I'm talking about. Amen. At any time, whether we're down at the store pumping some gas up at Kroger or wherever we are, we need to be strong enough to lead somebody to the Lord in Jesus' name. Is this making sense? Brother, when David was just a wee young lad, he was so strong in the Lord that the lion come by his way and he grabbed the old lion right by the whiskers and he whipped the lion. He defeated the lion and then there was a bear come along. He killed and slew the bear. Thank God. And then there was a giant by the old Philistine come along. Hey brother, he was so strong in the Lord. He took the Philistine's head off and praise God. We can be that strong strong when the devil comes along let him see your sword come out let him see your stone get ready to throw in Jesus name